everyone and welcome back to my channel, The Sun and Craft with Style. Uh, I hope you're having a great day. I'm having a pretty good one. Um, today we're going to do a, um, a Christmas stocking. This is, for, this is for my little sweet angel, my little great grand baby, my baby girl. And uh, so it's kind of a small, it's not huge, you know, uh, perfect for her. And she's going to keep it here, Yaya's house. Anyway, um, this is made, I made the, the stocking out of this gorgeous, absolutely gorgeous fabric. And uh, this beautiful soft satin. And uh, I bought this, uh, let me show some, oh, okay, that's better. Uh, I bought this at uh, Goodwill. It was kind of like, um, uh, I don't know, it, I don't think it was a top. It was something that went over your pajamas maybe. But the fabric is absolutely fabulous. The the top was a mint condition, and it was a dollar ninety nine. That is the cheapest I get out for a top at Goodwill. So it was fantastic. And around the uh, the front, over the neck, was uh, you know just uh, this strip of satin, and that's what I cut off and made the uh, the cuff for the um, for the stocking. And it's all sewn because I really wanted to keep this. I want to, hopefully she will keep it, you know, to remember me when I'm gone, <laughs> uh, which will be for a while, right? <laughs> anyway, and so I did sew everything and search it and all that. Um, anyway, so this is a stocking. And now uh, what I have here, and I tell you, I almost didn't make it, but somehow it worked. I had this beautiful piece of fabric uh, and I went in, uh, I had uh, coffee dyed it just to get that white white out of it, it which is perfect. It's just, it's just great. So happened to have enough to actually make for the front and the back, you know, uh, to cover the stocking all the way. So that's just what we're going to do right now. Okay. And, I was going to make it so she could take it home with her and enjoy it, but my daughter informed me that they all have matchy matchy stockings already, and I thought, well, it's okay. She can keep this here, and you know, and if she ever, when she gets older, she wants to take it with her, then she can. So, otherwise, I probably would have not made a, uh, a stocking, because we do have a lot of them. I almost hate to see the uh, the month of July come to an end because I have enjoyed making all of these Christmas, you know, projects. And guys, y'all got to check out some of the other um, ladies, crafters that they have tutorials like, you know, uh, Robin. Uh, Macron, uh, Kathy Lynn, uh, Angela Holt, of course, May, and we all know May, and a lot of other ones up there. This scrappy mommy, she is making some beautiful um, flowers. I mean, there's so many up there, you know. Uh, Sadie, I believe, is another lady. Um, a lot of a lot of wonderful telling up there. Check those channels because they were making, I mean, some beautiful, beautiful things. Uh, it's so, um, it's not amazing. I know all of you have talent, but they were really were making some pretty, pretty things, all of you. And I just have to say so because I'm real proud of all of you. <laughs> I really like this fabric and I almost didn't put any more lace over it, but you kind of still see through it a little bit, so it's okay. Uh, you know, it still shows a little bit. And that the pink is a really, it's a hard pink to describe, you know, it's not a pink pink. It's maybe a, a it has a, a pink, maybe with a little champagne color in it, if it makes any sense. And it's absolutely beautiful. Uh, I shop a lot at uh, Goodwill. Um, 
Mm, they were my favorite ones, but uh, some plants you have some that you like better than others. But I still shop a lot on all of them. And sometimes, of course, I don't find, I come home with nothing. And then sometimes I come home with a pretty good haul. Uh, so, you know, if you don't do it, keep in mind because be surprised what you can find. And not just Goodwill, but any kind of um, thrift shops or second shop or whatever. Um, they have so many names, you know. Um, but you, that, like the angel that I did, was a little top, a little tank top that I bought actually again at Goodwill. And it was beautiful fabric. My God, I would love to have yards and yards of that fabric because it was beautiful. So, um, yeah. You never know what you're going to find. You do have to look, though. Sometimes you may be lucky. You don't have to look for very long. And sometimes you do. So, you know, don't miss anything. Um, sometimes it's not necessarily with a, an area that you, you have sleeves. Sometimes the ones like I did at the tank top and got lucky. So, and this one was, and uh, I forgot where it was, this one actually. But I couldn't believe it when I found it. I just grabbed it immediately. Sometimes it could be an a evening dress, or I bought uh, an outfit that actually is, and it's lace. It's a uh, pair of pants, a top, and a bathing suit, and they're all the same lace. Beautiful, beautiful lace. So... Go ahead and cut that off around. I hope you enjoyed my video so far. I really appreciate all of you ladies and gentlemen that have subscribed to my channel. And uh, uh, I hope that I can you know, uh, keep you all happy. And if you have any suggestions, please let me know. I have a lady that she asked me to do maybe some more tutorials on, on some other alterations. Um, and it's not so much alterations. I think it is what it is. It's just giving it uh, a complete look to something that you already have. Or like I did my top uh, Tutorial. It was something that I bought that was very reasonable, and uh, I figured if I, if I mess it up, it's not going to be a big deal. But as it turned out, I love that top. Love it, love it, love it. Um, so, yeah. Okay, now we're going to go ahead and do the other side. very very lucky with this piece of fabric because I almost didn't have any and I really wanted to use it you know so I was glad I was able to I have some wonderful wonderful projects for the month of August uh, I'm not gonna tell you I'm gonna have one for every day because that'd be lying <laughs> I cannot do that but very nice projects, very interesting projects, and uh, and also, uh, of course, uh, uh, I will be doing the shoe alteration. There was one of the user scribes that asked me for it, and I have not forgotten, and we will do this next month. We're going to do a very unusual purse. I will not tell you. I want you to see the video, but I think you'll love it. It's very different than anything you had seen up there. Um, and I'm really excited about doing it. I already had done two. Each one have a completely different. And that, this one was going to be my third. So I, uh, I'm really excited about it. I'm also going to be doing, uh, I make the Nativity Village uh, every year. That's what we do. I'm Catholic and my, uh, ever since I was very, very little. As long as I can remember, let me put it that way. My grandmother, she was the one in charge of making the Nativity Village. 
and that woman was so talented she could make any anything out of paper and other paint and I mean just oh she was very 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 talented and so I took the um, maybe not the talent but I took the the job of making the nativity village every year when uh, I got married for my children and, the, and I always come first we always make the we call it Belen uh, you know from nativity and we always made it the day right after Thanksgiving and then one that was made then we went we went and made the uh, you know um, decorate a tree and all the other stuff but that had to come always first and the kids just love it it's been a tradition and my one of my daughters will keep is gonna keep it up so I'm really excited anyway um, last year I decided that I wanted bigger buildings uh, I watched Lola Temprado she's fantastic and I will put that uh, when we were making it, I would put her uh, channel there too because she makes some beautiful buildings. Now mine is completely different, uh, but also very recycled. Everything is recycled, and they particularly on my buildings. But when you get done with them, it will look just like actually a rock, a miniature rock building. Also, uh, what I do, uh, I love researching. So I do all my research on buildings and how they used to live then and so on. And some of them, I even have pictures of some of the uh, original buildings at that time. And uh, I've been trying to make them. I made one last year that I got a finished painting. And then I'm making one this year uh, that I'm going to be doing a video on it. And I hope you, you know, you like it. It's not a shabby chic, but... Uh, it's something that you might be interested in at some time, some of you. So I thought I'll go ahead and do it. Like I said, my channel is not only going to be shabby chic. I'm just going to do a little bit of different things that you might, you know, what I think you might enjoy doing uh, every once in a while just to change your pace. So it's going to be changing all the time, but I still will be doing shabby chic. I love shabby chic. And now that I have discovered it, well, hey, I want to do it all the time. I don't want to be left behind. <laughs> so, anyway, I just thought I'd let you know about that because uh, I'm really excited about it. And, and you'll be so proud of what is made out of some of the stuff that I make. You may even have a big chuckle over it, and it will be okay. <laughs> all right, so I finished up the... Oh, here we go. Let me cut some more in the top. I finished up putting the lace on the stocking, and now we're going to see what kind of laces I want to put. Because it's for a baby or a little girl, anyway, um, I was trying to think, you know, soft and, and really lacy and pretty. So, see if I can, you know, be able to do that. All right, the first thing I'm going to do, I've had some appliques, uh, which really, there are no appliques per se, but I cut them out of a piece that um, May Larson uh, creating with the tail store head uh, in a kit. Uh, the, it was, I think it was the Marie Antoinette, um, you know, shoe. And I didn't use it for my shoe, so I'm using it for this today. And uh, this is one of the pieces that I cut out and I thought it was real pretty, so I'm gonna put that one on the heel, like so. And then this one here, whoops, wait a minute. Whoa, I'm missing one. No, it's gotta be in here. Some oh here it is, okay. And I think this pretty little flower, I'm gonna put that right over there. Uh, in other words, uh, see that little well, let me see if I can see. See that little point? Okay, right there. They have one here, one here, right at the edge of that. I'm going to put it, you know, at the edge of it's going to be the boot, so, so basically that's what I'm going to do right there. I thought it'd be kind of cute. No, all of us have to be the same, it's why it's so wonderful about it. So far, I've watched so many videos and, and we're all different and that's what makes it interesting. That way you all don't get tired of seeing the same thing, see? We think about you a lot. Very sweet. 
And then this one, I feel it just fits really good right in here in the heel of it. And I may come out a slightly in, just slightly. I'm going to put some trim around it again a little bit, but I want to be sure that I do that first right here. So this is what I want to do so far. I may put something else, but right now that's like that's all I'm gonna do. Let me get my laces on and then we'll see what else I can get in here. Okay. Alrighty. Okay, let me go ahead and fold this back right now. So give me an idea. What I was thinking was put this one right over here and come all the way around it. And by the way, uh, most of the laces here so far, is with the exception, of course, the boot and this little piece in here, uh, I think probably all the laces are from um, uh, Creative with Detail store. Uh, so I just thought I'd let you know ahead of time. Thinking about doing this one here for sure. And then I wanted to do it also, right? Oops. Okay, I have it wrong side up. That's okay. I'll put it back up here this way. Oops. This way. Now we got it. Sorry. Okay, I thought about doing this in here and then maybe this one which I still have from the book. I just love this one. So Bay, if you're seeing this one, I need some bad. That's all I have, sweetie. Um, right in the middle. And I think that's gonna look so pretty. So I think that I'm gonna do this. I'm gonna put this one on first in here. This one, right? I want to bring it over a little bit. Okay, there we go. And now I'm gonna bring it back here also because I, I like it so much. And I'm gonna bring the, uh, you know, the laces around, but the rest of it, uh, I'm just gonna decorate the front of the boot. Okay. Let's see. Oops. Uh-oh. See, my first, I got made a blooper, guys. <laughs> Okay, well that's okay. Nothing venture, nothing gain. It's okay. One looking. Let me just put this one on first and then I'll do the other one. Maybe it'd be easier that way. No, none of us are perfect, so. So 
So it's okay if we do boo boos every once in a while. I do them all the time, to tell you the truth. <laughs> I do. Okay, that's good. Now I want to do this one right here. Oof. Hate those uh, spider webs. I'm just gonna turn it over. It's not that much. It's gonna make that much dif difference. And since, whoops, since I got put that little trim around the edges anyway, it's not gonna show. So I'm not gonna worry about it too much. Alrighty. Now hopefully this one's gonna be more straight. And likely on this one, I'm going to have enough to actually go around, which is awesome. So I'm really happy about that. Just maybe even have a tiny, tiny left. Wow. Can I get better than that? What I'm going to do is bring this over. I hate to cut it. It's not going to do me any good. It might as well be here. Okay. And then I'm just going to put this one and slightly overlap it on the other direction. It's gonna be okay. Alrighty. Oh yeah. So so far this is what we have done. And uh, let me go ahead and uh, this little bit in here seems to want to turn in. Let me go ahead and just kind of uh, make it stay. Just a little bit. Okay. Oh, I didn't do this one. Oh, that's hot. And I'm going to do the same thing here. I'm not gonna, uh, I like the down, you know, going down, so, and I think this is gonna be fine if, in case, if it does something, I'll just tuck it in a little bit, but I think it may be okay. There's so many other things that go over that it'll be fine. Okay, this is it. All right. Okay. I tell you, it was hard to figure, to know what kind of laces to put in here. I have so many of them, and they're so awesome, all of them. Um, but one thing I am going to do, whoops, uh, I still have some of this left, and I think this is going to look beautiful if I just put it over it. And so that's what I'm going to do on this particular one. Just 
going to start here and just make sure it's at the edge of the of the cuff okay right here you want this this trim in here to be right at the edge of the cuff oh yeah oh yeah I'm gonna like that a lot absolutely yes It's, it's gonna be so pretty, see? I like that. I was gonna put something else and I didn't I wasn't happy with it and I tried so many things and and I finally tried this one. So you know that's not bad. So hopefully you like it. If not, well I understand. <laughs> we all have different tastes and the world would be very, very dull if we like the same thing and everything would be the same thing over and over again, right? <laughs> so I understand. That's what makes life interesting. Alrighty. Oh yeah. I love this. Love, love, love it, love it, love it. And I'm going to go ahead excuse me uh, I'm gonna go ahead and finish right actually I think I'm gonna go all the way up but um, I guess gonna show a little bit so uh, I think it's gonna be okay I'm gonna go ahead and cut this piece in here because that's all I need and when you cut these things is I mean you may lose a little bit but if you cut around it a little bit it's great you don't have as much um, Praying or anything and it just makes it so much better so see so it works better at the end that way when I turn it'd be just fine okay let's see okay there we go all that and then I'm just gonna turn it and it's the only thing you're gonna do this little little bit in here that comes up this you know put a little bit of uh, just bring it tour you let me put some of the bring it in and then just kind of bring it back and it's going to be a slightly of a matter uh, where is it right there Let's see so and then that will come back easy and into it see So far, this is what we've done to it, okay? Now, what I wanna do, like I said, I try different things, but I think I wanna put this beautiful, on the cloth, this really beautiful uh, lace. So, I'm gonna see how I'm gonna do this first. Because I want it to go all the way around this, so I'm gonna flip this back up and see if it works. Um, I wanted some to, to kind of fall I want to bring this here that way when I fold it back this little bit of it is gonna go up I think that's what I'm going to do right like that
Let's see how that looks. Whoops. Oh, yeah. Yeah, I like that. I think it's going to look real pretty. Okay, let's just keep on going. It's going to hang over a little bit of our, our trim, but I think it's going to look just fine. I like it, I like it. Let's see. Make sure that the cutoff is way down here, so we're not... Okay, let's see. Okay, let's see. Alrighty, there we go. This little pretty little uh, little flower in, in here, it almost kind of fall right into the the slopes of the uh, of the trim, so it's kind of pretty. I think what I'm going to do is going to go ahead, let's see, I'm going to cut this around a little bit. Let's see what I can do without messing it up too much. Uh, I think I'm just going to cut it around here because it's going to be something else on the top. It's not going to show it that much in that area. So let's see, hold on just a second. Uh, well, maybe I do, I'm going to cut this right here maybe. Sometimes it's hard to know where you're going to cut it, you know? You, you hate to cut it all off, but at the same time... Yeah, I think it's going to work. Alright, I'm just going to put that over there. And this little bit in here, it's okay if it just kind of falls in there. Like I say, we're still going to have some more stuff in there. The back looks real pretty, too. Kind of give a little more kind of a, you know, character to the, to the cough. Okay. And now I got this, uh, let's see if I can find it. Oh, I got this, and uh, I'm going to go ahead and put it on around inside. I think it's pretty. Uh, so I'm going to go ahead and use it. I don't have very much left of this, so I'll just go ahead and and use it all up. Oh yeah, I think I like that.
kind of gives a little softness, I think, to the uh, top of the of the boot of the stocking. So I like that. Hot, hot. Okay, there we go. Oh, yeah. Yeah, I like that. It just, like I said, it just keeps it a little bit softer on the top. And I like that a lot. I think you can see it better down the bottom than you can uh, with a, a close. So, you know. Okay, well, we're going to, this is going to be part one, and uh, we're going to do a part two and finish it off. That means I need to get some things, some bling and some stuff, get together, and uh, we'll do uh, a part two. Uh, so we'll see you in a little bit. Bye.